Good morning, it's six o'clock. Just coming out to see if I can see much of the sunrise, but probably not because it starts at 5 30. But yeah, it's so quiet and peaceful here. So beautiful. I don't know if I caught that. You're beautiful. <gasps> Hi, babe. Oh, he's coming right up to me. Well, we're getting ready to leave this beautiful place off to Monte Verde. Only one night here, but it was a beautiful night, beautiful morning. We didn't leave too early, we wanted to enjoy this place. So we got the Airbnb or cabina all cleaned up, ready to go. Now we just gotta check out and head on the way. Should be an hour and 45 minutes to Monte Verde. We gotta stop for gas and then take some more mountain driving and yep. So we will either film on the way or film on the way up to Monte Verde. We'll see and we'll catch you then. Bye. Oh, and we also had the most amazing breakfast. I should I think I showed pictures of that already, but yep. So that's it. That's all. Highly recommend this place. Uh, El Mirador de Finca uh, Domos, something like that in Miramar. So definitely recommend it all right we're off well bye bye finca and mirador you were absolutely amazing now we were now we're going to back to metamog for some gas and then off to monte verde bye bye cloud forest we'll see you in a bit yeah because we are going back up to it anyways so now to go back down this crazy road that we showed you on the way up here and then off to Miramar. <music>
corkscrew, corkscrew? Switchbacks, whatever you call them. Look at this. Back to the town. Oh, look at this town overlooking the ocean. Oh, burning wood it smells so delicious. Look at this cute little town. No going forward? No what? going right. Sorry, my map closed. Holy brakes. streets. Well, we're back on the main highway heading up to Monte Verde. We've got another 10 kilometers and then we're going to be heading up another mountain road up to the beautiful cloud forest, Costa Rica. Can't wait. It's your birthday. Woo! Woo! Yeah, it's my birthday. Oh my god, yeah, my cheeks are still red. I was like, I gotta get a white brim hat. See, your cheeks are shiny too from the man. Oh man, that beach burnt us bad. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dogs driving. So we're gonna drop Brandy off at uh, some frog pond thing because she doesn't want to do the hanging bridges. And uh, then we'll do that and then we'll pick her back up. There doesn't seem to be any uh, cell phone data around here, like signal around here though for Claro. So that's gonna be an interesting one for Brandy, I guess. Yeah. But uh, I mean, for me, I wouldn't ever worry about it, but it's Brandy's first trip, so hey. But she'll figure it out. I can't really tell, like at first, crocodiles until you actually like point it out because they almost just look like the dirt. Yep. Road 606 to Monte Verde. So far it's paved and smooth. Yeah. I think they paved this road all the way up to Monte Verde though. It's the other side when we go down to La Fortuna that's going to be a bit more wild. Yeah. Yeah but so far so good. We'll show you the conditions of the road as we go up and see you there. I got, I got lost for like damage collision stuff on my credit card oh, that okay. I used to pay as well. Oh my. Here's where it gets rough. Oh, oh. Oh, wow. Oh my, are we even going to be able to get out of that on the other side? We're going to find out. Oh, that's Seems normal. Like a pop. Yeah, no, that's just a rock yeah. coming out from under the tire. Oh my god, are we even going to be able to get out of here? Oh yeah, I, I see a spot. I Look think we can this. get out. Might have to move that one rock. See where the tire treads are? There's a rock there. I'll see though. Oh my word. Mm -hmm. What are we doing in here? This is not alright. Oh, oh, okay. So is that, that's not good. Yeah, that wasn't good, babe. Like that hit something for sure. See, we're good. Okay, how about uh, no more listening to Google Maps here? Oh, <laughs> that'll teach you to pay attention. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy crap, we're not even done yet, but. Yeah. Alright, well, let's get back okay, on the trust paved. Okay, command. And if so, usually. Well, 
Well, there's all guardrails. Oh, there's a one lane bridge coming up. Whoa. Oh yeah, this is nice. There's guardrails and everything. Road up to Monte Verde from uh, Route 606 is uh, beautiful. Well, we're at the top of this little mountain. I don't know if we're going, we're probably going up still at some point, but at the top of this one done. Look at the nice, beautiful green hill. And now we're going to be heading down again. Wow. Such beautiful driving here. Tickets, we're ready to head in. This is where we go up the stairs, follow the green line. And let's get this uh, show on the road, I guess. Okay, so we got the map, we got uh, everything. We are going start of the trail. We're gonna go see some bridges. Wow. Is this whole path really gonna be concrete? Probably. Look at the moss covered trees. Look at that. Just so beautiful. I don't know if we're going to see much wildlife in here, but I'm hoping. Switchback number six. Coming up. Look at the huge tree. And we're still going up switchbacks. Just trying to look up in the treetops to see if I can see anything. That's I think that's the black billed toucan. Or it's a woodpecker. I think that's a toucan though. I only have 4K video, I can't really get it anything. That's so cool. Well, I think we just saw a black-billed toucan. 
looks like it anyways, but this is going to be an amazing little journey. And now we've made it to our first suspension bridge here. Isn't this awesome? Okay, bridge number one, fantastic. I can just imagine how the other one, like the longest one's gonna be a little bit wobbly on here. <laughs> I guess uh, you're lucky that you are in the frog pond, Brandy, and not on these bridges, because I don't think you'd like it at all. I'm just trying to hear where that noise is coming from. <laughs> oh, you just got muddied. I don't know. <laughs> oh. Boop -boo. what, what did I do? <laughs> oh man. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh well. Uh, that's what I get. There's nothing saving me. Is this rubber or like branches? That's just plastic. Well, we're coming up to the second suspension bridge. your mom on this this whole thing's freaking shaking look at this thing <laughs> brandy would be flipping your mom wouldn't even cross she'd be like okay i'll meet you back look at how high up we are way down there <laughs> wow look at that weird thing so filled in that you can't even see how far down that goes. Yep. Just like There's something here. You want to take this? I want to take a picture. Oh wow. See the second long, the longest bridge in here, right down there. Cool. Oh, that's where the zip line is, way up there. That's not our bridge. No, that bridge down there. No, up there. I thought that was ours earlier. Oh. Yeah, bridge number three, done. 
Oh, this is not the longest bridge. Bridge four, 413 feet. Hmm. New leaves are brown color to look like dead tree to fool predators. Interesting. Oh, that's cool. Makes sense, I guess. Pretty cool. Look at the people up there, eh? People way up there on the bridge. That's got to be a nice view up there. Oh, yeah. Well, that was a nice, they're all nice hanging bridges. Now we're off to the largest one after we go uphill a little bit again. Let's try to figure out which bridge we want to take the drone out for. Number two is my most biggest contender right now, but that means we got to boot it back up to that one. So we'll see how much time we have. And if we find another bridge that's better, this might also be the most popular one though, which means it might be full of people. Have you seen many people in here? <laughs> no. I think we'll but, be safe. So let's see how that goes. All right, we are on the longest bridge. Got the drone. We're gonna send it out over in the middle here. Hopefully we don't have any problems. And yeah, so you should be seeing drone footage very soon. Well, that was awesome. Hopefully we got some good shots for you guys. We still got more bridges to cross. Maybe we'll drone there, maybe we won't. But either way, at least we got at least one shot. And this is another one of those things though, not to be like a pessimist or anything, but once you cross one bridge, you kind of cross them all. But hey, it's all right. Still really cool, different views from each one. I still think number two would have been the coolest one to drone at, but that's okay. It's just the highest one, that's why. But, hey, pretty sure it all looks... Ooh, got some, Ooh, got some thunder happening. Oh, shit. <laughs> so now oh, we're just continuing to on to bridge number five or something like that. And then we'll see. Bridge four? Oh, they're just going back down? No, this is where we go. Bridge four. This is where we came from. Oh, right, yeah. Amazing, perfect timing for that. Yeah, good thing we got that in before. I don't know if you could see that, but that's the bridge that we were on across that we droned from up there. So you get down in elevation pretty quickly. Thunder and thunder is just a booming though, so hopefully it holds off long enough for us to get across the bridges and make it back to the car, but we'll see. All right. And here's bridge number six, 157 feet. This one's got a bit of a different walking platform. You can actually see through it. But this one's kind of cool. It's like right underneath the tree canopies and stuff. Oh, you can actually see a little waterfall down there. I don't know if you can see how high up we are, but there's a little waterfall way down there. So cool. I just love the jungle. 
This one's neat. Wow. So not seeing much wildlife. We've been hearing some. And I think we saw that black-billed toucan, which is what I think it is. And we've been seeing like little birds and stuff like that, but no sloths and no yellow-billed toucans yet anyways. But I'm pretty sure we're not going to, but that's fine. Ooh, it's thundering though. I wonder if they stopped the zip lining. Yeah, I guess so. There's a bridge up there that we just went across earlier. Still making our way around the jungle. Holy crap. Vine growing up against it. Look at that giant vine that's like halfway up there. Is that a vine or? That's a vine. That's a giant ass vine. Holy hell. That's a big tree. Oh, it's funny the sun's shining but thunders are rumbling and I felt the drop of rain I think so a little bit of whack yeah, weather going on in here wow I just love those mossy crooked trees or whatever you want to call them it's like their branches are going all over the place beauty and we're just making our way back towards the entrance and then go back and grab Brandy. Hopefully she's not too bored. And that's it. And just like that, we're back at the beginning. This was a beautiful walk. I just wish there was a little bit more wildlife, but hey, we got to see the black-billed toucan. So that's really, awesome and it's good it's really humid and we got to see all the different plants like look at the size of these friggin leaves man it's insane and all the palms <sighs> and the mossy trees my favorite so now we're just gonna head back to the car I'm gonna change back into my sandals and go get brandy I guess. Yeah, it actually feels nice though. It's because it's kind of hot, so. Treetopia Park. Are you with 52? Are you worth 52 Canadian? Honestly, yeah. But it could be cheaper though, to be honest. It would be like more enticing if it was only like $30 Canadian. But oh well, it is what it is. All right, let's head back in and head back to the car. I don't know if they can see the rain. But it looks beautiful. It's raining. Got a little bit wet, but at least the rain's warm. Now we just gotta go get brandy and possibly just go eat some cake or whatever. And yeah, that's about it. All right, well, we made it to our Monte Verde Airbnb. It was a little bit harder to find because it's not a legitimate sign. So if you're ever staying at the Ocean View apartment in Monte Verde, then it's like the beige house looks like this with that gate there across from the white building on there. Yeah, it's not too bad. So our place is just up the stairs here. Not much of an ocean view because it's all clouded over because of the cloud forest. But see, that would be the view there. But there's no view right now, but that's okay. Quite the neighborhood over here. We got ourselves a doggy pet for the night. <laughs> it's just holding onto my arm. Hey, what you doing, buddy? Aww. So, this is our room. Not too much, but not too bad. It works. We got an induction thing over there with some stuff so we can actually cook some eggs or whatever. Oh, Fantastic. Ew. Yep. 
And if it was clear, we'd be able to see the ocean from here. Yeah. And then in here's the bathroom. What? Nice shower. Oh, yeah. Holy moly, is that the rain? The tin roof? I actually kind of like it. Out, out. Okay, so this is it. So we're here for one night. We're gonna figure out what we're gonna do for the evening and then tomorrow we head to La Fortuna. Well, later we're gonna do the frog thing and then head to La Fortuna tomorrow. All right. <laughs>